go. Coin toss. She's recording now. Looks like Cookville's going to receive. So Blackman won the toss. They'll defer to the second half. We're going to gather. Here we go. What a beautiful crowd tonight. And there's that cannon. Woo, scared me, Judy. I forgot about the cannon. And the Cannon Cup folks are out tonight. Here comes the Blackman Blaze. Head coach Kid Hartsfield. Beautiful. Quarterback, like I said, that's Stockton Owen. He could go to Brown. He's going to be a scholar. Going to be. Watch him go. Stockton Owen with the pass. Boom. Got it. That's going to be a pass complete just up to about the 27-yard line. He gets it up to about number 12, and that's Harris Cravens. Andrew Hudson Jackson and uh, Kid Hartsfield said this guy had one of his best games against Siegel. Andrew Hudson Jackson is the bell cow, and that's who they give it to. And here he comes up to the 30, 25, 20, 15, 10, 5. Touchdown, Andrew Hudson Jackson. Touchdown, Blaze. Blaze on the board. And it, with a little handoff to Andrew Hudson Jackson. Boom. Now you're Coach Maynard. You got to score, kids. You got to get six. And there you go. 8.55 left to go in the first. Blackman on the board, 7 nothing. People, I asked uh, Coach Maynard the other night if he'd let me come and do the broadcast. He said, no problem. Here we go. Bryson Jones with the kick, and he lets it go. This is a two-man shot. Judy the Beauty and Star. Oh, the ball's on the ground. Goodness me, number five covered it up. Waylon Whited. Slippery. Slippery. Judy the Beauty just doing a wonderful job. Our sponsor tonight, John Jones, John Jones Real Estate. Nobody sells homes like John. Logan sides to the right of Stockton Owen and twins to the top and one to the bottom. They send the man in motion. Stockton going to keep it, go right up that middle, kids. He busted him. He's going into the end zone. It's going to be a touchdown. Stockton Owen, touchdown, Cookville Cavaliers. It's fixing to be tied up here on the plateau. As the fireworks or the confetti bomb goes off here at Cookville. That looks, and we're tied. 16 left on the clock. Give me a little something, something, Dean Fox. Well, about a big guy. Give me some stats on that one. Welcome to, or you can download it. Nice kick taken from the 15 up to the 20, 25, 30, up to the 35. Almost up to the 40, 42, 43. He gets it out of bounds. And that was number 20, Jalen Pleasant for the blaze. Nice return by Pleasant. Moving Andrew Hudson Jackson around a little bit. Now Beam going to fling it. They complete it over to number 14, Jerriton Thomas. And Thomas, wow. He gashed them, kids, and he brought it into Cookville Cavalier territory. He's got it up at the 30. Third and eight as the viewers continue to build on Stork Vision from a shotgun. Twins to the top, one to the bottom. Andrew, oh, 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 they got him wrapped up, and that's number 20, Jalen Pleasant. They call Pleasant in the backfield. Number 38 is back there. Let's give him some songs. That's Clayton Barrett. So Drew Beam could... Just pooch punt it, twins to the top, one to the bottom. Cookville sucking in now, coming closer, coming closer. Here we go. And they completed first down, 20, 15, 10. He got it up to number seven, Mark Cooper. So from right up tight, Drew Beam. Oh, he dropped it. It's on the ground. It's on the ground. And now Cookville's recovered it. Cookville's recovered it, and they recovered it at right at about the 17-yard line. Number seven recovered it. Dare Drew Dial. Watching Stork Vision. I'm sure Will Kreisky's watching from a shotgun. Stockton Owen fixing to go to work. We're knotted up here on the plateau. Coming this way. They give it to number five. Oh, and all the way up to the 30-yard line. That's Waylon Whited. Number five, Thomas McDaniel. Right now, Stockton Owen from a shotgun. And here we go. His feet rest on the 24. Pulls it, goes on that left side. Look, boys, he just gashed him and almost got that first down. Again, it whited. Whited on that left side. He's almost got a first down. He's still on his feet. 
Oh, he's up to the 30. Wide to the right of him, and they're in a tight set. Need a first down to keep the drive alive. Send a man in motion on a jet sweep. That's what they're going to do. They give it to five on the far side, way and, way and wided. And he's not going to get it. They ran him out of bounds, kids. Gene Carr and Jeff Childs got me into this daggone mess. Anyway, Drew Beam from a shotgun. Andrew Hudson Jackson to the right. Two-step, three-step drop. Looking downfield to catch some heat. Coming this way. Let's it go. Oh, it's picked off, kids. 30, 25, 20, 15, 10, 5. Touchdown, Cookville Cavaliers. Donovan Sullivan, number 17. What a play. Beam let it go. Sullivan saw it, just ran it right into the end zone. Said he, he said three weeks ago on the show, he said, Stork, I don't know when I've not made the playoffs. So he plans on making it. PAT attempt is good. So... 602 left. Cookville 14. Blackman 7. We're in a ball game. In the first quarter. And now Cookville on top. And they're kicking off. From the 15, 20, up to the 25, up to the 30, 35, 40, up to the 45, up to the 50. He's out of bounds. Let's see where they step it. Right at about the 48 yard line. Pleasant on the return, got up in it quick and took off. Yeah, Lebanon, Le, that Lebanon Rossview makes the fourth seed out of 6A, so they'll play uh, Oakland right. Beam completes it out to Dowdy. It's going to be a first down. People just Not wanting to be a part of this broadcast, I'm telling you. Here we go. Pleasant. Pleasant still on his feet. He's going to get the first down, kids, and keep the ball and keep the ball in Drew Beam's hands. Big number 77 in there on the stop. Alex Delt. Reach 18, Laverne to 7. Here we go. Second and six. Whited on this side. He's not going to get much. That's going to flip that clock into gear. We're about just going to get out of this first quarter half. That's what we're going to do. Kids, I'm going to take a break. We're going to turn down the audio. Everything's cool. Give me a break here. Let me rest my pipes. I'll give you 24 minutes here in just a few minutes. This thing ain't over. You heard team working with a shotgun. Twins to the top. Great game going on here. And they give it to Andrew Hudson. Jackson Boyd, he's wrapped up, I mean, by that Cookville defense and swallowed at the 30-yard line. And it's going to be third down, third and eight, looks like to me. Drew Beam going to need a level two pass. Now we got number 38 in there, Clayton Barrett on that left side. Stockton only going to run it on that left side. He's going to get wrapped up quickly. Kitts adjusted his defense, and he's attacking Stockton Owen. Elijah Smith is in there, number one, right here. They bring twins down here. And he's got number four, Evan Whited, right there behind him. He gave it to Whited up the middle. Ooh, he got busted there by big number five, Chris Harden. Fourth down. It's a running play. Should have kept the clock. Now it's running. 529. I know my football. From a shotgun. Two-step, three-step drop. Throws a long fade pass to the corner. Touchdown. They're on the board. That's number seven, Mark Cooper. Touchdown, Cooper. Things fixing to be tied up. Now we're in a real ball game, kids. Tied up at 14. Just like, we tied up just like we started this thing. Zero, zero. From a shotgun. Pulled it right up the middle. Stockton Owen saw it. Got a first down, kids. Greenbrier 7, White House 13. That's a big game. Stockton Owen from a shotgun. Twins down here by me. One to the top. And that's sides. He lets Sides have it. Sides coming this way. He's got five yards. He's got 10 yards. He's got 11. He's fighting. He's got 13 yards, and he goes out of bounds. Number 10 was there. Cameron. Looking to pass. He's got Pleasant in there blocking. Beam running for his life. Beam. Ball on the ground. Ball on the ground. Cookville's got it. Cookville Cavaliers got it. I bet he's got a TI-35 calculator, just like Chris Moffitt. 
Twins to the top, one to the bottom from a shotgun. Drew Beam looking, looking, passes, and he completes it to number seven. Huge completion to Mark Cooper. That's going to give him a fresh set of four. Chain gang will move. Boxman will reset. Here we go. Drew Beam, pump fakes, lets it go. Oh, gosh, he's got number three, Todd Lark, and Lark's going to go into the end zone. Touchdown, Blackman Blaze. Touchdown, Todd Lark. No flags. Joe Burns, 42, Pickett County, six. Hold for the PAT, and it's good. That's going to put seven. No, it wasn't good. No, it wasn't, Judy said. 20 to 14. Christian Brothers 24, NBA 17, so Coach McDaniel's winning. Scores coming in, but they're starting to finalize as we get through week 10, game 10 of the regular season, the finals. Stockton Owen is by himself looking to throw. Man in motion. Hands off on a jet sweep. That's Evan White coming this way. Brings it into Blackman Blaze territory and up to the 39-yard lines. Stockton Owen. And Logan Sides trying to get on the board. Plenty of time. Logan Sides right up the middle, kids. He's ripping. He's going to the 20 and right up to the 17-yard line. Fresh set of four given to Stockton Owen. Chain gang will move. Boxman will reset. Wow. Jimmy Maynard likes to run it. And they all come both McDaniel and Maynard come from that ranking tree. Twins to the top, one down here. Ooh, Stockton Owen right up the middle, kids. 15, 10, right over somebody's helmet, right out of the seven-yard line. Elijah Pitts, first and goal. Gives it to sides up the middle. Side, side, sides, touchdown, Cookmo Cavaliers. Logan Sides, wow. We got ourselves a game, kids. Okay. Stockton Owen, the holder. They're on top by one, 21-20. Cookville. Final, White County 20. But they got a quarterback that can, he can throw it, he can throw it back to Murfreesboro from here. Let's see what he does. Feet on the 30. You don't need to be in a hurry. Quick reverse coming this way. Oh, my goodness. They've got it. Here you go. Todd Lark. He got a lot of it back, and he's going to get it up to the 25 of the Cookville Cavaliers just on a reverse. Here we go. From a shotgun, Andrew Hudson-Jackson to the right. Drew Beam from a shotgun. Here we go. Drew Beam going to take it. Drew Beam's going down. That's a bad decision. Bad decision. Clock's running. 12 got him. That's Harrison Cravens. Why the region champions? They're perfect. Here we go. Here's your field go with a buck 57 left. Bryson jump. He got it. That's three points. But... 152 left. Still plenty of time. 2008, somebody may be able to chime in. We did go through that Z factor where everybody made it to the plows, but I'd say it was 2008. Because uh, Phillip made it in 2009 when he got there at Blackman, and they've made it ever since. From the 35, from the 40, big runner. Big runner, and they're trying to push him out of bounds. That could be, oh, it's getting it's getting skippy. Jimmy Maynard trying to calm it down. 24 came in there violently, Jaden Payne. We got it on video, I assure you. That looks pretty gibberish to me. I can't see nothing. Try that again. Here we go, Stockton Owen. Logan sides to the left of him on a fourth down. This is it, kids. Got to make something of it. That's it. That's it. Ball turned over on downs. Blackman is going to win. Blackman's going to the playoffs. That's it.
Way on up the street in 23 seconds, and the Blackman Blaze will be playing next weekend, next Friday. And it looks like they'll be playing Hendersonville, and that'll be a good matchup for round one of the playoffs, according to Dean Fox, the Fox at Rocks. He's working those final stats. My sponsor, John Jones Real Estate. Nobody sells homes like John. Young lady that operated the camera tonight. Nobody does it better than her. That's Judy the Beauty. The cannon sounds to signify the game is over here at Cookville. Can't thank you enough for joining us. Hope we did our job. I'm just waiting on those stats from Dean Fox.